Hello guys, the DB Grinder here, back at it again with another video. And before we hop in, if we hit 9,000 subs by the end of the month, I'm going to be doing a giveaway. And we have a Mondo with 761 rating versus GG Good Game with 1,076 rating. So it's going to be another high rated DB video. And let's hop right in. We're going to see a Mondo when the rock, paper, scissors shoot. And he's going to decide to go first 40 versus 43. Opening hand is Psychic Tracker, Torn Scales, Rhoda, Dark Magician, and Fog Blade. Sucks to draw this, but he definitely has combo. His hand is good. And he has Choo Chi, Gamma, Nib, Quing Long, Lulu. Yo, this, this is actually going to be really good because he has two high impact hand traps plus, like, you know, he has this. And then he has all of this. So it's going to be cool. It's gonna Rota, add Cloak, and then Normal Summon Torn Scales, Effect, get rid of Cloak, he's gonna drop Gamma on that, and then bring out Driver. I don't know why you would Gamma there, I mean, I guess, but he just banishes Cloak, add Boots, Summon Torn Scales, Summon Boots, and he's at the same spot he was before. Cloak, and then he also gets Torn Scale. I think this could have been played differently by him. Summon out Psychic Tracker, and then goes for Cherubini, Cherubini effect, send Graph, and then Graph effect, bring out Seer. So I'm gonna overlay in the Sea Dragon. He's gonna use the effect, bring out Cloak, and then goes in the Rusty. He's gonna Rusty, send Gloves, set Shade. And then he's gonna use gloves effect, change shade. So that means he's gonna send fog blade. And then send fog blade, fog blade effect, bring back ancient cloak. It should be an attack, and then use the effect to make this gang 800. Then he's gonna make link spider, and then goes into anaconda. You could tell he was doing that because he turned a non effect monster into an effect monster. And then on summon, he's gonna get hit with nib. Um, yeah, there's just no more extenders there. He's gonna get Seer, bring back Cherubini, then go on the Link Spider. Plays what? He plays two Link Spider? Okay. This dude's crazy. This dude's actually just on the double Link Spider, double Anaconda combo. You love to see it. Anaconda dump. I mean, I guess this comes up often for him. Where he wouldn't be playing all of this. He's gonna get boots, add fog blade. This is insane. This is through Gamma Nib. He's gonna have Dragoon Fog Blade. I think the Gamma was used very poorly, but still. Draws Choo Chi. Activate Quing Long and then use Lulu effect. Um, I mean, you like you obviously you're gonna negate that. That's the best virtual world. Yeah, negate that. And then moving on to the next game, we're gonna see virtual world go first. Opening hand is Psychic Tracker. Tour. This dude just opens up nice every game. And then no material. Um, this card's decent. Like, it's, it's good, but it's not, like, insane. Like, it used to be against, like, Orcus. And he has Cosmic and Psychic Wielder. So, holy, like, this dude just opened up insane. Like, Cosmic for the Choo Chi has all this. And he has Nyan, Ash, Nib, Desires, Quinglong. Please, Desires, get him somewhere. Don't want this to be a quick 2-0. Draws Roshi and Talons. Alright, we'll take it, we'll take it. Um, see what he banished. Nothing too bad, just some one-offs. Some hand traps, we see like Lancia, Ash, Nub. He's got a normal summon Nyan, Roshi effects, and Quinglong, summon itself out, and then Quinglong effect, that's gonna add Lulu. And then discard Quinglong, so now he has a follow-up. It's gonna go in the Shin Shin, and then Lulu effect, sending Quing Long, bring itself out, and add Choo Chi. Nyan, bring itself out. 
and then overlay make number 75 set and then pass so you know this is this is very solid i mean he has a macro he has a monster negate he has a well that's awkward i was gonna say he has a pop but he just doesn't so he he has he still has like four interruptions draws torn skills i mean it's gonna get hit with cosmic yeah cosmic that normal summon tour guide effect bring out graph now imagine if he had another two chi set and now it would be live brings out graph then bring out psychic wielder and then goes into chirubini uh, all of that spanish because of sheen sheen Chirubini effects and ragged gloves. That's not banished because it wasn't sent from field. Summon out psychic tracker. Goes into the sea dragon effect, bring out tour guide, and then graph effect, bring out seer. Overlay into another sea dragon. He's gonna use gloves, sun cloak, sea dragon effect, bring out gloves, cloak effect, add boots, summon out boots. And then makes break sword, break sword effect on itself in the virtual world. He's going to chain number 75 to draw, draws droplet. Droplet effect to negate the synchro. And then he's going to go into rusty, rusty effect. That's going to dump torn scales, set shade. And then boots effect. Um, he's gonna, yeah, boots, add fog blade, and then torn scales summon itself out. And then shade summon itself. He's gonna get rid of all three of those to go in the Nightmare Unicorn. He's gonna use that effect, shuffle back the XYZ. Goes to battle phase, unicorn attack over, its attack is halved. In the main phase, he's going to drop Nib. I don't even know, like, what he was going for there. Like, honestly, he was just kind of, like, throwing stuff on board. Like, even if he outs everything, like, he just loses anyways. Seer, bring back Chirubini. Now, he can do his, uh, Link Spider into a Dragoon Package. Like, the Dragoon package is so strong, but it's also so bad to draw. Like, I know one day the package is gonna be good. Like, if everything slows down, like, this engine could be really strong. It's gonna pop, and then battle phase attack. And then pass turn, leaving this in hand for Dragoon. Dragoon's obviously better than Fogblade for Negate. Draws Desires. He's gonna banish two, bring back Sheen Sheen, and then banish Quinglong, add Roshi. He, uh. He didn't dump there, right? Uh, yeah, he forgot to discard. I mean. It's, it's not gonna matter. Brings out Roshi, bring out Lulu. And then Nyan bring himself out. It's gonna overlay in the break sword. It's gonna set Chuchi, break sword, pop that in Anaconda. And then desires, banish 10. It's gonna draw e Telly and then GG. He's gonna use e Telly. It's gonna bring out Lulu. Surprised he could use that to summon from deck. He only has three cards left. I guess we'll go over the banished off desires. I just figured it was gonna be game already I mean it's going to be game in like two seconds summons out vermilion overlay in the VFD VFD effect called dark he's gonna dragoon negate that and then talents to take and then I mean he has it's not game I mean he has fog blade to summon back it's almost game 
Um, this also negated Dragoon. I mean, Dragoon negated VFD, so this should be at 4k. Doesn't lose its attack when it, you know, switches sides of the board. Um, he just tried the. Oh, okay. He was trying to Dragoon negate Fog Blade, but this card is a uh, once per turn, per copy. If it's said you can only use the effect that Dragoon once per turn, then he'd be able to use it since he already used it. It's to bring out a break sword. Uh, Dragoon effect, pop break sword, and then moving on to the next game. I mean that was uh it's unfortunate on his part for making a misplay there of what to summon. But I think he was gonna lose that one anyways. But now game three of the opening hand is Red Eyes Fusion, Psychic Wielder, Fog Blade, Danger Snake, and Shade. So that's uh that's pretty strong. He has two level threes to bring out. It sucks to draw fusion. Uh if this is the only one that he plays, he might even just use this as his first play. Oh man, I I hate to think that, but he has so many Phantom Knight cards in hand too that like going for the rusty play could really only give him like an extra fog blade. Then he has uh, Kaloon, Lulu, Talons, Gamma Seal, and Nyan. It's going to activate Fusion, doesn't get punished with Ash, brings out Dragoon. Ash on this hurts. Very bad. Set Shade, set Fog Blade, pass turn, draws Driver. So, uh, what? You just Gamma Seal. What are you doing? Don't do this. You don't want to resolve talents that bad, do you? Think of it as if you drop a kaiju on this, and these are both fog blades, best case scenario for Amondo, then he's still going to need hand traps to stop you, and you can use talents to then do something afterwards. To like hit the last card out of hand, or draw. I think that was risky. He's going to send Quinglong off the Lulu, and he's going to get to add GG. Then activate GG effect. That's going to send Choo Chi, bring itself out. So now he has follow-ups for next turn. Summon out Coral Dragon effect. He's going to pop Fog Blade, chain it on the Coral. He's going to normal summon out a Nyan. And then goes into Vermilion, Coral Dragon, draw Roshi. He's going to use Vermilion effect to pop Shade. Then he's gonna activate Roshi effect, send Quinglong, bring itself out, and then effect, bring out GG. Then brings out Shin Shin, battle phase, beat over Gamma Seal, and then attack with Vermilion. Main phase 2 goes for VFD. So He's going to use the effect called Light, and then Quinglong effect, add Nyan, and then discard Nyan. He's going to get to add Roshi at yeah, end phase, and now he has two Virtual World cards banished for Chu Chi. He also has Quinglong as a follow-up, Roshi, and then VFD to stop his opponent. So he's just going to use VFD called Dark. And then he's just going to admit defeat, can't do anything afterwards. His hand was very bad really does suck to draw the fusion it, it forces you to activate it half the time because if you don't then you're just setting up fog blades versus virtual world that doesn't really care about fog blades most of the time so that was kind of rough Let's see how long the match was the match was 46 minutes long it did not feel 46 minutes long uh, virtual world does take a while to combo with though there's a lot of thought process behind it minor mistakes can really make you lose with this deck uh it's kind of like the same thing was like zoo if you do like minor mistakes you get punished heavily that's how a lot of the decks are right now but that that's just how it is but that's gonna be it for the video like comment and subscribe the db grinder signing off peace have a nice day